Oh, great. Wait, seriously? It was gonna make us dodge that, right? I can't believe that that was actually a thing that it wanted us to do there. Or, I should say, expected us to do. That really sucks. That really actually sucks really badly. I'm gonna get these Stygian out of the way here. Because I don't want this guy to actually do some attacking to us. There we go. Oh, I wanted to get a launch off. That's what I wanted, but uh, that's okay. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, you're seriously telling me that Stygian hit us. I'm gonna kill that thing so badly right now. But I'm really glad that uh, Dreamwalker's in a little bit uh, closer quarters for us because we have a chance to really mess it up here and see if... Okay, well, we got the Stygian out of the way. That's really all that matters right now. Beautiful dodge. Get you up in there. Oh, we waited too long. We could not launch you, sir and or madam. We'll just wait for you to come out wherever you are. <sighs> God damn it. There we go. Oh, yes, we got him. Oh, we almost got him again, I should say. Wait for him to come along again. There we go. Perfect evade. Smack him in the back. Oh, we got him again. That was really fast. I'm actually fairly surprised that we did that. Okay, so let's continue on with these laser puzzles that I'm guessing we have to complete perfectly to grab an achievement here. That's, that's really, you know, it's sad that that's all I worry about right now. So let's just make sure we don't mess up here. Beautiful. Okay, we have another one that looks to be not that difficult. Just make sure we get one more jump going on here. There we go. Awesome, we made it. I like that. Hopefully there are no more lasers to grab, so let's get up in this main elevator area, as was stipulated by Ms. Cat herself. After, of course, we get all the completion elements, because you know me. Because, you know, I haven't said that a million times already. But hey, look at that. We got 2,000 red orbs. We're about 3,000 away from actually getting another health upgrade. But, you know, that also means we can buy some more gold orbs for ourselves there. Which, really, if you think about it, is just a great idea for us. So, hey, we got ourselves another divinity statue here. I wish you were allowed to regen health here by waiting. But I guess beggars can't be choosers in this situation. Hopefully we are not going to get destroyed here too much because I feel like every time that stuff pops up something really bad's going to happen there. I think I see Virgil in the elevator so I'll make him wait a little bit on my account because I really don't mind making him wait. I don't think there's anything for us to grab out here that's interesting so you know I'm just going to continue on as I said before after of course I get these red orbs make sure all the completion elements are done. Hey Virgil what's up? Here you will rendezvous with Virgil. Seems an underestimated cat. I didn't really care about her about all of this you once said you didn't give a shit take the elevator up to floor 154 here dante take this i took it off a security guard might look like a taser in the real world but it's a powerful demon weapon in limbo thanks New weapon unlocked, Kablooey. Fires explosive needles that stick in enemies and can be manually detonated. I like the sound of that, buddy. Let's see, let's get our Kablooey out here. I don't exactly know what we're gonna have to use it for, but I guess it'll all be apparent in a second here. I just don't want to miss anything. Okay, I'm oriented with myself. Let's let's see how this thing works. Okay, that, that doesn't look too bad. Let's see, shoot that. How do you... Hold on a second. Tells us to shoot and then A and X is... Oh, we probably don't have detonate unlocked just quite yet. So <laughs> let's just continue on before I die. Oh, really? You think you're going to have... I think, think I'm going to have an issue with you. Let's detonate. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Oh, wow, that worked really well. Oh, yes. Okay, we're going to back off and uh, detonate our Kablooey here. Oh, come on. I, I definitely dodged again. Oh, boy. That was close. Okay. So let's shoot it. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, okay. You know what? I don't really like your shield on your person, so I'm just going to shoot and Kablooey you. There we go. Awesome. You just had to get a sh rid of his shield. I, I had a... I was under the impression that it got rid of shields very well, but uh, I guess I was incorrect in my assumption there, which is fine. We'll just take out those guys really easily. I don't even think we needed a Kablooey for them, which I do like, because <laughs> I do like my 
options, and that's also an achievement too. Just uh, retrieving all the weapons will give you, uh, I believe, 20 points each. So you gotta like it when you get it. That's all I gotta say. Oh boy, that was close. Kablooey. Oh, look at that. I love Kablooey. 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 It just rolls off the tongue, especially when I repeat it in a very obnoxious manner. Okay, get out of the way of the attack there. And we'll finish you off with the Aquila, because we ain't no spelling bee. And our tornado should take you out. Oh, wow. I'm actually very surprised it didn't take him out. But there we go. We finished combat nonetheless, and we will continue on nonetheless. I really want to get over there. It looks really cool. I mean, it, it looks angelic, like ore or something, but it just is awesome looking. And I like it. I'm not going to go there just quite yet, though, because I saw a lost soul over here. Obviously, you know my motto. So I will finish this guy off as I possibly uh, can probably finish the completion. I'm not... I, I probably won't get a triple S because I didn't find the other door or the other key. But that doesn't mean the level's quite over yet. I'm guessing we have another laser puzzle though, so I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll just run right through the middle here. Oh boy. Whoa indeed. Okay. Let's grapple up. And we should be good to go here. Finish... Our, our, our a little run in the park, if you will. I'm pretty sure Mundus doesn't like the fact that we're doing pretty well, though, so I guess uh, that's not going for us there. Let's see here. Looks like we'll have to... Oh, I'm sorry. This is what I want to do. Use this. Get through here, even though Cat's talking. I, my apologies, once again, for cutting off all that ambient uh, conversation, but it's just how I, I talk, man. This is, this is what I'd have to do for you guys. Give you commentary. But uh, you can read the subtitles as well. It's, that's really the main reason I put on subtitles, because I know stuff like that is going to happen. Oh, we got ourselves a... Oh, really? Is it a copper door? It looked like a silver door to me, man, but I don't have any copper keys, so... I guess we're done with this floor. Let's just continue right on. We're on floor 154. I don't know how much higher we can go, but I guess we'll find out. That looks like the core of the door that we're going to have to deal with there. Oh boy. Let's, oh man, these harpies are really going to give us trouble, aren't they? Oh yes they are. Okay, that's fine. Smack you down on the ground there. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. I like that combo, so I'm going to continue to do that combo because it destroyed them really easily. Oh boy. Ugh. Enrage Breakers. The Kabooey is extremely useful for getting in behind enemy defenses. Using four darts, it's even possible to break enemy enrage states. That's pretty sweet. Let's uh, fire four darts on one. Oh boy, I wanted to get a dodge on there, that's fine. Oh yes, Kablooey, you up in the face. Finish. Actually, I want to finish the Harpy off first, because that just seems like the best option for us. Oh, man, you're really giving us some issues here. I don't like that. Just smack you up. And of course we didn't have to use the Kablooey on you, because we already killed you before the Kablooey could really do much issue to you. So, we'll punch you down, finish you off. There we go. Okay, he's in an enraged state right now. That's fine. We'll actually get four Kablooies onto you. Three, four, and uh, we'll smack you around a little bit. That's fine. Let's actually wait till he gets into a rage state here. Oh boy, here we go. Just like that. Oh, look at that. That did so well for us here. Let's actually get a full... Oh, what I wanted to do is a, a full launch, but I guess that isn't going to be an option here. So we'll just get four Kablooies on you again. There we go. Got you a Kablooie right there and see if we can launch you. Oh, there we go. Oh, we couldn't do much with it, though, which is unfortunate. And we couldn't rip him out either, so... Back to Kablooey. Kablooey you! And we... I don't think we... Yeah, we didn't detonate anything, because I don't think we actually got any stuck to him. I think we actually have to get him stuck to his back. His weak spot, if you will. Yeah, there we go. Now he's now he's all lit up. I like the sound of that. And there we go. Looks like Drekovac is the his actual elite guard here, and he's goddamn fast. Holy crap. Oh boy, there we go. 
Actually, you know what we could probably do is use our Kablooey there and do a lot of damage to him there. Let's see what he does there. Oh, look at that. Kablooey did so well. Look at that. It does a really good stun job. There we go. Look at it. broke him again. Oh my gosh. I like the Kablooey. Boom. Like, do you, do you even lift? I don't think so because you're dead. Well, you will be dead in a second. That worked. Oh boy. There we go. See, you can even do it like an AoE type launch with the Kablooey there. Look how much damage we're doing. Beautiful, man. I like the Kablooey. We'll just finish him off there. Yeah, see? Oh, it's so good. I, it's kind of cheating, though. We're not getting much combat um, points for it. But I guess it, it, it works really well. I don't know how much health the Kablooey actually does. But we're definitely going to fully upgrade that damage when we actually get the opportunity to. Because it's doing really well for us right now. And it's getting us a lot of damage on him. And I like the sound of that. Oh, come on. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that either. That's fine. Oh, come on. You have to actually get a little bit of distance on him with the Gablooey. Oh man, it looks like we're going to have to do a little bit more platforming while we can here. Oh, I wanted to get this health because... Oh, okay, I'm guessing the earth will crumble before our feet or else... Uh, or unless we don't keep moving. So let's see how fast we can actually get to this core here because that's going to be the deal here. There we go. Beautiful. And we'll get our next pull up here. And this looks like to be the final one that we have to grab here. Knock, knock. And mission 16 is over. Holy crap, is that a long one? But is that a good one? Let's see how we did. We probably did okay, but we died and that wasn't so okay. But we did pretty okay with the completion time. Half hours is as good as a half hour is gonna get, my friends. Minus, you know, cutscenes, obviously. But we did, wow, we almost got all the, the tormented souls, the lost souls there. That's pretty huge. Although the death is gonna take a little bit away from us, we still got an S out of it. So I guess you can consider that a pr pretty successful here. Let's actually check on our next mission here. Our next mission is called the Furnace of Souls. And although it sounds very enticing, I think I'm going to have to take a break. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this little episode of DMC Devil May Cry. This has been Duff King 56 I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.